Hello everyone, we will continue the topic session method. In the previous video, what we did, we ran the program and after that, the session entry came into SM35. We processed the session and we checked the log also. If I will go for the log, this is the log. Now we need to check the accuracy of the data because the last step is always you need to check is the data migrated correctly into SAP. So I will check these materials in Mara and MAKT table. So I will go to Mara table and what the materials got created. P mat 72, P mat 74. And you can see we have the five materials date, time, we have the industry sector, we have the material type, and we have the unit of measurement. Everything is correct. Similarly, we can check in MAKT table the descriptions. Now I will pass P mat 70 to P mat 74. And you can see five materials descriptions are there. It means data migrated correctly. Now what we will do? In the previous case, I processed the session in foreground. Now I will go for background also. I will show you the background. So what I will do, I will run the program again. I will change the data in the file so that it will create a new material else we will get an error. So I'm just changing the data in the file. So whenever you will run the program in which you use the session method, I'm uploading that data. Whenever I will run this program, a session entry will be there in SM35. I'm executing the program. Now, after that, I will go to SM35. And you can see there is one session entry. At last time is 357, latest time. The status is new. Now I will go for process. Previously, we processed in foreground. Now I will go to background. And it is similar to a no screen mode of call transaction. We will directly get the result. We processed. I will just go to SM35 again. Now you can see our session processed, our session processed. Now I can check the log. You can see these materials successfully created 90 to 94. Similar way, we can check the accuracy of data that these are correctly created or not. So we can check in Mara and MAKT table. So I will go to Mara table, P mat 90 to P mat 94. Execute. Five materials, proper data is there, material type is there, industry sector is there, unit of measurement is there. Now, similar way, I can check in MAKT table also. P mat 92, P mat 94. And we have the materials and the descriptions. Similar way, we can go for error also, display errors only mode. If there is an error, it will show the error. It will show the screen where the error is, else we will directly get a result. So you can see the, we have same to same modes as that of call transaction method. 
in the call transaction, we have all screen, no screen error. Here we have foreground, background, and display errors only. Now I will go for a important point. When we call the function module BDC open group, we pass the key parameter to X. Keep means it is X means it is true. The value of keep is true. You process the session. Your session entry came into SM35. You process the session. And keep is equal to true at that point of time. It means what is the meaning? It means after processing the session also, it will keep this entry. It will keep this entry. See, we process the session, but still it is keeping the session entry. Our session entry is still there. Now, for the best understanding, what I will do, I will put keep is equal to false. I will activate the program. I will change the data in the file so that you can understand fully. Suppose I will go for different materials now. I will save this. Now we will upload. I will run the program. Now we are running the program. We are creating a session, but keep is false now. I will upload. New entry will go into SM35. If I will go to SM35, you can see we have a entry. Entry is at 4 o'clock, 4 to. Why I'm saying the time? So that you can understand the result. I'm processing this session. This entry is with keep is equal to false. I am processing the session. Suppose I will go for foreground only. First material. We have the second material, third material, fourth material, fifth material. Done. Now, you can see now, there is no entry of 4 to now. It means after processing the session, it is not keeping that entry. If you are going for keep is equal to X, after processing the session also, the entry will be there. But if you are passing keep is equal to false, session entry will not be there after processing the session. But now the question comes from so many people. Session entry is not there. How I can check the log? It does not mean that you will not be able to check the log. Session entry will not be there, but you will be able to check the log. Log should be there. So you can simply click on to log button. And you can see we have two tabs. One tab, you can see all the logs. Log with session, logs without session. If I will go to logs without session, you can see we have the entry of 4242. Four, this is the our log. If I will click, you can see PMAT 95 to 99. So it means if you are going for keep is equal to false, you will not be able to see the session entry here after processing the session, but it does not mean that log will not be there. You can check the log. Log will be there. You can go to this dedicated tab or every log will be there. We have an entry of four o'clock two. So that's it in this video. We will go for more, more things in the next video for this session. Thank you.